We're at 812 now. Chef Kevin is getting ready for Halloween. He's making a, a brew here, almost like a, a witch's brew, but it smells wonderful. It's lentil soup, and you're saying it's a good thing to have around for, for, for like a Halloween party this weekend. You know, Halloween, it's always so many sweets. It's nothing but sweet, sweet, sweet. But if you had a witch's costume and stirring over this, it would have been perfect. Oh, my little pretties, yes. <laughs> there you go. Come to my kitchen. And you know what I started off with? A little bit of oil. Yeah. A little bit of a red onion. Yep. And a little bit of green onion. Which okay. smelled wonderful just did right there. Yeah, just sauteing that off. Yeah. Then I put in breakfast sausage. Okay. And just let that fall apart and crumble, and I've had that sauteing. And so how long do you have to cook lentil beans? You know, they you cook soak for them about first? 20 minutes. No, you don't have okay. to soak them. I put in chicken stock, and I let them go for about 20 minutes. All right. During that 20 minutes, they get nice and tender. Okay. And, it, you know, any soup, the longer it cooks, the more the flavors blend together. Oh, yeah. Gang, okay? And I, and I use the chicken stock. And I let that simmer. I put in cumin. I put in a little bit of all-purpose seasoning, a little bit of garlic, and I've just and a white pepper. A little and bit now you've still got to add the pumpkin and the uh, black beans. Pumpkin is going to do something. Pumpkin, you may not think about it. It'll but thicken it up a bit. It's going to thicken it up. It's going to give it some body. It's going to give it that kind of a potato type flavor. Oh, okay. You know, and if you don't have pumpkin, you could use sweet potato. Some people like sweet potato more than they do pumpkin. But this in the soup here. And that's here, just canned pumpkin right there, isn't just it? Just canned pumpkin. You could take fresh pumpkin and cook it down if you want. Yeah. I've taken black beans. And, just out and of the can, right? Out of the can, but I rinse them. Okay. Rinse them really good. This is going to complement those chickpeas. And, and, and the, the pumpkin really changed the color. of It, it looked like a, a black witch's brew before. And, and now it's all of a sudden got a little green tint yeah. to it. And this is something that's unique. Salsa. Okay. We're going to put in a little salsa Give a little because spice. it gives a little spice as well as a little tomato flavor. I also like to put in, besides the salsa, I'm taking some fresh cherry tomatoes. Yeah. That we're going to drop down in there. Now, now what, are the, what are the limes for? You just squeeze those in, Yeah, right? I'm going to just squeeze a little lime. You know, a lot of times I think why people don't like pumpkin sometimes and sweet potato, it needs that little bit of a pop. Okay. Lemon juice, lime juice gives things that little pop and now, that now you need. Could, will you add all those tomatoes eventually? or? Yeah, I am. Okay. I'm going to put some in now, some in later. I have another little pot going over here for April because she doesn't eat meat. But, but you could do this without the sausage like I'm doing. Okay. Well, the, we like with the sausage. Now, the, the bones you've made are pretty cool. Those actually turned out really nice. Yeah, and you know, gang, here's the deal. You boil the dough to create in, in the baking soda, right. so it creates that crust of thing. And then thing. you bake it. Yeah, then, then you bake it, all right? Bagels are salt, boiled. salt and what on there? And Parmesan cheese. Oh, that's going to be good. Bagels are boiled to get that chewy texture, but here you need that alkaline from the baking soda to get that pretzel crust. And you dip that into the soup, right? We're going to dip that into oh, the soup, and we're going to finish this off with spinach, Eric. All right, if you like this recipe and it's a good one, you can go to our website, www.tv.com, and click on the morning show page. It'll be there. Dave?